Oh my lord. He's dead. Very unfortunate, but he is dead. This is, uh, I think even a regular super would kill him from here. But CA certainly will. Regular super does just, just barely under half health on most of the cast, right? Geef's level 3, if you don't know, does a lot more than any other level 3 in the game, basically. His his regular level 3 does 4,800, where I think a normal CA does 4,500, right? So Ryu's level 3 does 4,000, and his CA does 4,500, right? Geef's level 3 does 4,800, right? So his, his level 3 already does more than any CA in the game. And then his CA does 5,300. Like this thing does an absurd amount of damage, right? Like it's 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 so it's so good. <laughs> it's, it's it's invincible, and it's like you know it's it's uh, if you, you you jump either you either jump like before the flash happens or you die. Like this this is all, even when, even in season one when Geef was was really bad. This this move was so broken. All right, folks, we are back for more Ooh, Street Fighter Six. I thought the Ryu was uh, just chilling for a sec. Just you know, uh, off to out to launch. But here he is. We got a Ryu. Hello, Ryu. Oh, God. Probably doesn't frame trap. It should frame trap, but I guess I hit maybe too high up with the chop. Or maybe I just did the headbutt too slow after. That's also possible. I just was playing some Grand Blue here, so let me try and not get too haha funny by my muscle memory. I almost I almost dashed at the Ryu, certainly. Okay, thank you. Jumping medium kick. Very silly jumping button, certainly. That's minus. Oh, not minus enough for me to knee, though. 14 frame startup on that thing. The emerald green suits Geef quite nicely. That's what I thought. But everyone else tells me, you know, your 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 skin is, is so ugly and I hate it. Bonk. Bonk. There you go. Frayed combo. That time. It, do, it do, It's supposed to frame trap. I just got it wrong last time, I suppose. Oh! Oh, the buffs aren't enough! Okay, okay. Yeah, it's still it's still the, the first one is still certainly will still can still certainly hit, and then the other ones whiff sometimes. You're gonna jump at me, I think. You've been doing that quite a bit. Oh, you're gonna dry rush over. Oh, but you ain't gonna mess it up. Cool. I was gonna jump at me. That Ryu has jumped at me a couple of times uh, in those, you know, scarier spots before. That time he decided to just murder me instead, though. Luckily for me, he messed up his link, so we're all fine. We're doing just okay. He's not back ticking either, so I got a lot more of uh, a lot more like fake Oki on this guy than I probably should. Oh, well, speaking of which, I need to wait. Is it not? Oh, those two buttons in back. I'm not back ticking either. I don't. I don't do that either. All right, it's plus because he has it. It's uh, it's it's Ryko buffed or whatever. Okay. Nice. Nope. Okay, cool. Oh, nice. Okay, okay. I wasn't ready for him to jump back with me there. Get swept, nerd. Mm -hmm. Oh, driver show red. Oh, he's still gonna mess it up. Oh, he's gonna mess it up really badly. Okay. Sure. Works for me. Apologies. Yeah, he, 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 he's, that link is causing him some trouble. You can, uh, you can tell. I'm pretty sure you can't donkey kick after that anyway, right? I enjoy the way you can play and talk so nicely. I do commentary for local tournaments. Sometimes my brain just fries. Too much information going on. I, you know, it certainly is. Uh, oh, oh, you. It certainly is something you, you, you just practice and uh, get better at the more you do it too. No doubt. Get yeah, reset, nerd. Hit confirms are for cowards. Ryu apparently. I, I, I don't know what exactly. I don't even think. I mean, level three is certainly. Uh, you know, that was because yeah, I feel like you can tell pretty easily the donkey kick whiffed there. But uh, I'm not sure entirely what he's trying to go for after the drive rush overhead. Because like, that overhead's not special cancelable, no. So I'm, I'm quite certain, I mean, none of the overheads are, they shouldn't be anyway, if I, if I understand my game correctly. Uh, so I'm not entirely sure what he's even going for doing overhead into Donkey Kick. But like, I don't I don't think he's plus enough to do that. You get like, usually off Drive Rush overheads, you get like, you know, a medium confirm or something, not like a full special move. I think, though? I mean, Geef does not have a Drive Rush overhead in that sense anyway. So I couldn't tell you, but I thought that was... <laughs> my bad. Okay, that's on me. Whiff into DI, the classic. He's not gonna level three me. He's gonna do that. EXDP? No. Fair enough. Take that. Oh, I, mean, I guess I shouldn't take that trade, but it's fine. Oh, god damn. Jumping medium kick, my beloved. EXDP? No. Yep, yep, yep. This is, uh, I think even a regular super would kill him from here? But CA certainly will. Regular super does just, just barely under half health on most of the cast, right? Geef's level 3, if you don't know, does a lot more than any other level 3 in the game, basically. His his regular level 3 does 4,800, where I think a normal CA does 4,500, right? Am I right about that? Like, what is what is, uh, what is Ryu's level 3 do? I think it does 4,000, right? Yes, yeah. So, Ryu's level 3 does 4,000, and his CA does 4,500, right? Geef's... Level 3 does 4,800, right? So his his level 3 already does more than any CA in the game. 
And then his CA does 5,300. Like this thing does an absurd amount of damage, right? Like it's 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 so it's so good. <laughs> it's, it's it's invincible, and it's like you know it's it's, it's uh, if you, you you jump either you either jump like before the flash happens or you die. Like this this is all, even when, even in season one when Geef was was really bad. This this move was so broken. There's a way to. Uh, uh, I heard you can do like a, a 720 standing if you go like half circle back, half circle forward, and then oh. Like half circle back, half circle forward, and then up. But if, if like to, to do a 720 without buffering it, basically. But like, I can't for the life of me seem to get that down. It's like uh uh, one two no, I'm getting SPD. Yeah, it, I maybe maybe may, may I got fed a uh, some propaganda. I can literally only do standing 720s on level uh, leverless. I, I I have no idea like what the input is for them even right. Like even if even if actually doing the input is tough, I'm not sure what you're supposed to be doing, like how you're cheating the input reader, right? Because a 360 needs at least one up-ish input, right? Like an up left, up right, or up up uh, straight up. So I'd assume a 720 needs two, but apparently it does it. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. Also, hello, Bogo Pogo, Mr. Kenneth. Okay, sure. Bad time to jump. Good time to jump. Better time to jump anyway. Third time's not the charm, as it turns out in this case. Okay. So I gotta keep in mind about Jinrai is we can uh, if he does the low Jinrai we can just SPD him. I don't think it's I don't think, it, I think he's minus four not minus five so it's not like a punish, but it is uh, still maybe it is a punish actually. Can't remember if he's minus five or minus four off the light Jinrai follow up. I've been jumping at this guy way too much. Let's uh, let's calm down a little bit here. Minus oh punishable. I didn't think punishable. I just thought minus, but no. I guess it is just like a heavy kick. I'll take that trade honestly. Okay safe from that spacing no it's not really i thought i spaced that out well enough i was very wrong a doken i oh, didn't well splat him horrible news probably wants to jump over me is my guess yeah oh, that's also bad certainly nice unfortunate for him but very nice for us it's kind of jumped a little bit after him there and went clean over him essentially but I don't, I don't know exactly what the tech is to do a standing 720. I just know that I can't do it. Whoa, that still hit him. I really thought there was going to be like, you know, we crossed him up and like we didn't use our cross up button. So we're going to hell. All right. I wanted to lab out how to back tech as well, because I definitely should know how to do that more than I currently. Is he dead? Oh, my God, he is, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that wheel kick punish counter does so much damage. That is uh, 5,520 damage, if you didn't know. So it's even more than a CA, right? That punish counter. Uh, wait, so, cause I forgot the input to back tech. I'm pretty sure you, uh, it's like you hold back and hit two buttons or something. Let me only pause the matchmaking real quick so I can figure this out. I'll pop back in before the bracket. What time does it start again? It start again? It starts at 8 p.m. So we'll be, we'll be back, uh, to like, at like 7.40 or something. Enter. I think Automatic did a shorts on YouTube showing how to do a 720. He just turns really fast. Really? I feel like I'm gonna, I feel like I would always get, again, there's gotta be like an input trick to it, right? Like he might just do it really fast. He's really good, you know. But there's gotta be like a, there's gotta be like what what is the like there's gotta be some theory behind how you're getting the input reader to think that you're doing a 720, even though you, you like you can't be. If, if you're actually doing like a proper 720, of course you have two up inputs in there. Or like, yeah, like if you're doing a full 720, you have six up inputs in there. So there's something you're doing to trick the input reader. I'm just not sure what it is. Anyway, Ryu, could you uh I don't know like what what, what knocks me down? Probably just like a sure you I guess yeah that works. Uh, hit me please. How do you back tech? Oh yeah, so it's is it? Yeah, so it's, it seems like it's two buttons. The new trick is actually you don't need six uh, 360. Yeah, so it's 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 seems like it's hold back and two buttons. Okay, okay, that works for me. Yeah, got it. I gotta do that more because if you don't back tech, you eat a lot of fake Oki that you shouldn't be eating. Input tricks they don't actually need 360. Levelist exposes that really well. Hmm. Yeah, fair enough. You only need one up. Yeah, so okay, that's what I was told then. Yeah, that it's like you can basically do like half circle. Like, like two half circles and then one up, right? So you can go like half circle back, half circle forward, and then up or something. And that does a standing 720. But I don't know how that works. Like I, I, at least I've not been able, even though I, I know that in theory, I've not been able to actually do that yet. I will say I've been trying for, you know, about two minutes, but still. Ow, 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 ow. Again, probably should have back tech there. Gotta keep that. It's, like, it, 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 it's not a slower wake up anyway, so probably should be doing it all the time, I imagine. Like even in the corner. I don't think it affects uh, frame data at all, right? Okay, okay. Oh, nice throw. Saw her burnt out. Wanted to DI that. Oh, okay. I'm dead? Yeah, if they spend level one, I certainly am. 
On level list, it's 4, 2, 6, 8, 4, 2, 6. Oh, you do the up in the middle? I would have thought you would do like, you know, 4, 2, 6, 6, 2, 4, 8 or something. Okay, sure. Oh, nice. Can't jump over that. Yeah. That's. Oh, wait, what? I'm supposed to be able to chop that. I guess I was too slow. Normally, she, she can't really do that at all. Oh, wait, are you still on the other side of me? When did this happen? Yeah, yeah. This is what, it's what Kimberly can do sometimes, certainly. This puts you in a blender that you never escape from. And that looks like what's happening to us right now. Ow. Bad. I'm supposed to be able to chop that, uh, that, that heavy kick there when she flips, but I just messed it up. There you go. Yeah. That shit's not real. Come on. Get grabbed. Oh, oh, she can punish you for that? Okay, I, I knew she could backflip away like that to stay safe. But I never knew she could input a, a button to actually uh, stop it. That's interesting. To actually, like, hit you out of that back when she's backflipping like that. I had no idea. That's very cool. Get swept. Oh, okay. Heavy, heavy punch, a little bit uh, ambitious there, maybe. Fine. Extending this. Look at this corner carry. Very well done. Overhead shirt. Oh, okay. Jump medium kick. It was not active for long enough there. Still works. Even though it's supposed to bait anti-airs most of the time. Tried to throw her out of that whiff. No such luck. Had a feeling. Bonk. Bonk. Nice. Nice easy punish there. No need to do it. go for anything fancy, alright? This heavy kick hell stab killer. Works out pretty well. Nice. Check her like that real quick. Oh, nice. Okay, okay. Guess right on the command grab. Well done. Owie. My face. There goes that corner carry once again. Oh, that's a reset. I didn't even realize that was like a, something I could tech. Yeah. Okay. Okay. My bad. Get away from me. Okay. Nice. Didn't back throw me back into the corner. I guess that's something. Oh, she's plus there? I think I've like learned, I like relearned that lesson like seven times. I always like mash on that, and then I get murdered, and I wonder why. Oh, okay, that beats the eye. Got it. This is well, yeah, this is very bad. I was, yeah, that's that's very bad. That's very bad. Being in burnout there, and her just getting out of burnout. He's plus on that uh, that little kick. That way, that seems. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lab that in a second, I think, because that seems actually wrong. I wonder if did I not hit my crouching leg kick? Did I hit my crouching leg punch or something? Oh, nice. Jumping, holding up on the possible reset combos there. I see. You. Nice. We can damn near kill her for this. Actually, we can't. She is just dead, actually. I lied. Yeah. This is, again, 5,500 damage, so a little bit over half health on the entire cast. So, a good bit over half health, in fact. And it's even half health on Geef. That's, uh, far H, right? Wait, what are you talking about exactly? Which, uh, which button? From which character? Bonk. Put her in the blender. Put her in the infinite. Bonk. 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 One, two. Nice. Big damage. Oh, okay. Burned herself out for that. Interesting, certainly. Again, that beats the eye. I gotta be careful about that when I see it. Oh, body splash. Why? Okay, okay. Kimberly's kick that you think is plus? It's it's out of a command dash, I think. I'm actually not entirely certain. I think it's out of a command dash of sorts. Are you dead here? Oh, you're not. That's horrible. Hey, on the right side, you do love that. Which is much better news, as Kimberly is very aggressive on their wake up. Kimberly does not have a reversal, but they really wish she did, and uh, they are playing accordingly. Oh, nice! Yeah, again, that, that will just snipe my jumps out, as it has done a couple of times before. Okay, nice delay tech there. Getting a little bit better at that recently. Stay down! Ooh, the headbutt, though, was a little ambitious. He was not in. He was not up yet to be able to get hit by a headbutt. Oh, my five. Uh, 5LK got murdered there. Unfortunate, but it happens. I'll take that trade. Oh! Sure. Oh, oh wow! Even though, you, when you whiff a throw, you, like, extend your own throw hurtbox quite a bit, but even still, it wasn't quite enough to catch them there. Nice. Thank you. Jumping medium kick. You're the homie, for real. Are you dead here? I think you are. Yeah. I think this, I think this kills the, the Kimberly. Indeed it does. Nice! We'll take a look in a second here, Bikini, because I'm actually not certain uh, what move that is. I just know what it looks like. We'll look at her command list and see what we can get up to here. Uh, let's get her on here, in fact, first. Hello, Mrs. Burley. 
Command dash kick is plus one, I think. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. I, it doesn't look like it should be. It might, like, I just, well, just, you know, on, based on my knowledge of nothing, right? But when I look at it, I'm like, oh, it's, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a, nice, it's a nice hit, but it should be minus on block. But looks like it may, in fact, be plus. I mean, if you're saying that, and I got a counter hit for, I think. We got SF6 early, X. Yeah, we're going to, uh, we're going to play uh, in Kerbio's bracket at 8 p.m., Suki. So we're just going to, like, we're kind of sandwiching. We played a little bit of Grand Blue, like 30, 40 minutes of Grand Blue. Then we're going to play some Street Fighter, and we'll go back to Grand Blue and end with Grand Blue instead of ending with Street Fighter like we normally do. Uh, since Kirby's bracket's a little bit later. It's slow, though, so they want you to hit it? Yeah, yeah, I suppose. That's the other, yeah, there, there's that, that's the other sort of class of moves in this game that I don't uh, realize exist enough, right? Moves that are supposed to be hit out of startup, basically. Not, like, on reaction, just, like, you know, just for them doing a move that close, you should be, the game expects you to be sticking out buttons to hold your space, and if they stick out a button that is that slow, you should get, they should get bopped, right? Uh, it's, yeah, it's this. Yeah, it's this. It's out of the command. So it's quarter circle forward kicks and then light kick? Wait, is it only light kick? Wait, what? Is it back? Eh? Quarter circle forward. Oh, I'm, doing, I'm hitting a punch. Yeah, I'm, I'm an idiot. Don't worry about me. Huh? There you go. I, I keep getting, I keep, I keep hitting punches instead of kicks. That's my bet. So if we record her doing this, right? Wait, what? Oh, if, if she's too, if she's too uh, close, she'll do. There you go. That is plus one. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. It's slow, but still fast enough that's hard for me to check. Yeah, I mean, it's 21 frames? Okay, okay. Yeah, so it's, I don't think, uh, you know, that is, that is reactable. You can straight up react to that. But I guess the, the dude kind of like just wants you to check Kimberly's command dash in general, right? I think. Like, as she's kind of running at you. Like, the whole, the whole, like, even the whole command dash that it comes out of, I think, is sort of designed for it to be checked. So that's the idea. I, I think, anyway. I assume that's what their, their intention is with that move and with that whole, that whole part of her. Cool. Yeah. All right, well, now we know. Please stop, Mrs. Kimberly. Dragon Lash is the main one for me. It's slow, but still fast enough. That's hard for me to check. Yeah, dra I mean, Dragon Lash, I think, is is a heavy Dragon Lash is like straight up. Is it like 27 frames or something? Like Dragon Lash, in theory, should be like straight up reactable. But for, I mean, for most characters, you're reacting with what? Like your DP? Like it, reacting with a DP input takes time, right? That is, like that's going to add a lot of lag just by, you know, virtue of existing. Uh, and being kind of a tough input to do like on a, on the on the draw like that. They want you to parry it, I guess. React and then just parry it and fish for the perfect parry. But you can't, I mean, I, I've Larry did Dragon Lash on reaction, but because Geef has a one button anti, right? So you can kind of like modern it, basically. It's still tough, though. Even, even for Geef, it's not like, you know, it's not like, at least for me, I've not found it to be, like, this free to do that. Oh, God, nice. His heavy punch is faster than my crouching jab there, funny enough. That thing is five frames. So, kind of, haha, funny. Me, it is minus three if he just does it like this, though. Oh, nice. Okay, okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Perfect parry. So, true best, dude. Not gonna get that much damage off this, but he will get a drink, which I guess is very valuable for Jamie. Is he minus if he drinks in my face like that? It felt that way. I wasn't a punish, right? But it felt like it was my turn, certainly. Like I could uh, move before he could there. This is minus again. Could consider SPDing that on block, honestly. Yeah. Because again, it's, it's not always oh, a lot. I could have showed the medium SPD. That's my bad. It's not a punish, but he's minus and safe, which again, for Geef, is not really safe at all. Yeah, you're just in, a, in, in another 50 50, basically. It's a five-frame move, and it does a lot of damage. You can't block it. If you're scared of getting uh, SPD, then suddenly you're jumping on your safe minus frames, and then you're just going to get counter hit, right? Or just not counter hit, but like hit out of it. What in the? Trying to beat out. See, he, that he, even though he was safe on block there, he recognized he was in a 50-50. So he just DPs to keep himself safe, and, uh, you know, doesn't work out very well for him, obviously. A problem has occurred during the match. Oh, it's Tuesday! Oh, yeah, it's Tuesday! So true! See Manus. This doesn't usually happen to me in SF6, but right, it's Tuesday, right? It's the okay. Well, what do we want to do for the like last ten minutes of this video? What do you guys think? Maybe we could like replay. Uh, yeah, I, 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 it doesn't usually happen on SF6, but right, it is Tuesday, and it is Steam maintenance. That is so true, bestie. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do. I, I forgot. Yeah, I forgot too, man. You know, what, let's do. I want to do a replay review. Uh, since we're already here, since we're since we're kind of stuck, not being able to play the game anyway. Oh wait, can I not access the CFN? Oh, oh, I. I can't, I can't, you can access your replays even when everything's offline. 
Never mind. I was gonna say it will be nice to do like a bit of a replay review against Kimberly because Kimberly is also a character where even though we won that set, a lot of things are happening all the time with Kimberly. And I'm sure that I'm letting her get away with a lot of minus on block stuff. But even though for some reason this tab is open, you can't look at anything. You, oh, you have to save. You have to like save them, right? You have to save your replays to local or something to be able to access them offline. Okay, so what we'll do instead, what we'll do instead then, is we will, I guess just, we'll, we'll, I'll check some of Kimberly's regular moves and to see what is minus and what isn't manually. It would have been much nicer to do it through the replay review, but we'll, it's, you know, it's fine. We'll spend like the last 10 minutes or so doing a little bit of that. Because uh, this character does tend to, like, in the in the rounds that I lost to that Kimberly, it very much was, like, I just had no idea what the hell was going on, right? And usually, like with Rashid, usually that means that somewhere along the way, I'm letting them get away with something, right? So if we just have, let's let's kind of just go through the whole the whole gamut, I guess. Uh, let's look at, like, just all of her normals, basically. Her jab's minus, every jab's minus, right? But again, it, it, it looks like this. So as you're doing that little back fist, she's minus two, got it. Uh, every jab except Geef, but you know, it's a whole thing. His jabs are slower, so they get to be plus. Uh, this is also minus. I think I, I think this one, I, well, it is cancelable though, right? Like it's minus, but it's cancelable. So you gotta, you gotta keep that in mind. Like if they just do this and nothing else, right? This is certainly something that I can uh, I can take my turn back on. Got it. I think I, I think I do let Kim get uh, let Kim's get away with this a little bit too much sometimes. Like doing like one, two like this or something, which is obviously not real. Uh, that's plus one. I didn't know that. I, I, I always assumed this was only because Kim's like this out of drive rush a lot, right? So I always assumed that this was uh, just plus only when they drive rush it, but no, it's plus even when they don't. So got it. So that's plus one. Already learned something. Yeah, leg kick minus two, of course. Uh, I assume minus four. What's this punishable? You don't say. Okay, so the double overhand there is punishable. That's plus two as well. Okay. Again, this is one of those ones that I thought was always just plus after drive rush, but no, it's plus all the time. Again, good. I'll, I'll take that. That is good learning. What about command normals? Obviously, she has them out of the command dash, but... Uh... uh Kimberly all the way up there. Hello. Unique attacks. Oh, this, yeah, this one's, I'm pretty sure, like, very minus, right? Over the can be blocked while crouching. So we got down forward, medium kick. I wish I could, like, keep this. I wish I could, like, have, I wish I could have this, like, in front of me while I do it, but. Even SF6, Blouse 2M follows me. Yeah, plus on block uh, 2M right there. Seven frames, too. It's, it's, it's the exact same thing. Yeah, so this, yeah, this is like super punishable, right? But they will try it. This is like you can meaty, like you, not, well, yeah, it is meatying, but not in the way people usually describe it. You can hit very late into the active frames, this one, especially out of like Kim's, Kim's left, like drive rush from squ full screen and do this, right? If you do it early enough, I'm sure it can be plus probably. Ooh, hold on, hold on. Uh, Wait a second. Yeah, it's hard, but if you do it from far enough away, it can be plus. But usually Kim's will like, you know, we'll get a little bit closer and do this and it's still punishable even out of the drive rush, right? Uh, she had, what was it? It was this. Yeah, so this, this is the interesting one. I know that normally if Kim tries to do anything out of this, it was my understanding that she's, you know, yeah, you can just chop her and she's, uh, dead regardless. Right? Um, uh, but that Kim went, like, they did this and they hit me right away, right? Yeah, like, with that right there. Is that always gonna, is that, would, would that is that always gonna, because I, I, I was always, you know, very comfortable seeing that move. I would just, like, credit card swipe and hope for the, and, you know, assume that Either I'm gonna hit her or she's gonna back off and it'll be fine. But that looks like maybe it's not the case. So let's let's try that real quick. Uh, so if I do this and then immediately match that as fast as I can, right? Which I think is roughly what that Kim did. Yeah, what if I what if I only hit it once though? What if I only hit it once? That was I kinda matched it. It's possible I, it's possible I hit it twice, and that's where bad things happen. No, no, it's a punish on the first, yeah, it's a punish on the first jab. Interesting, yeah, so you gotta be a little bit careful with that. I mean that's not she can't get she's not gonna get very much off of that, right? Like, she's, she's not very, it's not like she's plus off of that or anything. Or, I mean, it's not like she's plus enough to do something off of that more so, right? But that is, that is certainly something to think about. She's plus 15. Actually, can she drive rush and combo off that then? Plus 15? I, I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. Not, not from here, I don't think. She, like, if they're super on the ball, she might be able to, she might be able to drive rush off of that and hit you for it. Hold on, hold on. Kim, Kim, stop, stop. Uh, I don't think so, but it's close. I mean, because you, if you do like the, if you like the, the instant drive rush, we go forward, forward, right? So it's, hold on. So like from this distance, right? Okay, you want to do that, you want to do that, that instant, right? It, it, that, the, the quick drive rush that I'm so bad at where he had like forward and then forward parry. Oh, I guess, you know, the point is you can get the drive rush out in a frame and then how quickly can you hit a button from there? Ah. Uh -huh. 
And if you do that, if you do it perfectly, I think you only have to parry for one frame, right? I think you can. I think I, th I think it's actually. I think if, if the Kim is super on the ball, I think they get a combo here, right? Because that's again the parry. I think ideally you can you can be parrying for only one frame. I think or no, is it, does it have to be three? It's like no matter how how like what, well I think I'm doing it, I get three. Maybe you have to be parrying for at least because the purple frames are the parry frames, right? On the frame meter there. Maybe you have to be parrying for at least three frames. It's possible. Okay, in which case, I think it's real close, but I don't think you can do it. In which case, I think it's real close, but I don't think you can actually do it. If you have to be parrying for three frames. Yeah, because, like, it's it's active on, like, frame 16, literally, right? Like, she's active on frame 16 there. Because she's parrying for three frames, drive rushing for, and starting up the attack for 12, and then it's active on frame 16. Okay, okay. I, I still, it's, it's still good. I mean, it's still good for her, because, like, no, again, I've, I've always thought of this move as just, like, you know, when you see this... Just like you mash the credit card swipe and you'll be fine. Maybe it's a better idea because the credit card swipe is 18 frames. That's 15. Does this will this hit her if she flips though? Maybe it's a safer idea to mash this instead, right? Let's see. Let's try. Because that, that was a very interesting uh, interaction that I didn't expect there, right? So first off, let's just try doing this into the flip like that, right? Did she do that now? Yeah. So if I block this, you know? Yeah, but if, oh, okay, but if I'm already crouching, it like whiffs, right? I have to be like standing at first. Oh, yeah, it's 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 much more inconsistent. But the question is, is this even worth doing? Because does this even save me from? Yeah, it, it seems like this is not an answer, unfortunately. It doesn't hit high enough. Yeah. Oh, even from what? What? Okay, I was gonna, yeah, even from there, it, all, it looked like it didn't work for a sec. Even, but even if I even if I do do this, uh, the close M or the not close M rather, the two L two light punch. Sorry, my my grand blue lingo is, is invading my street fighter my, my street fighter brain. Stop! I always, I always have such a hard time getting the... I always forget the button to like get them to stop doing the recording. Uh, so if she does this again, right? And I do the, the crouching light punch, does that even save me? Or do I still get punished? I still get punished anyway, yeah. So just like, I mean, it's not that big of a deal if she can't combo off it. I'm not sure if she can. She gets a little bit of damage, basically, right? But it's certainly interesting that she can't do that. I mean... Let's see, here's, a, here's, a, here's an interesting question. What's going on, Anu? We're playing some Street Fighter a little bit early here because we're gonna we're gonna go into uh, a grand blue bracket at 8 p.m. So we're kind of flipping around the order of the stream a little bit. Hope you're doing well though, Anu. Wait, so hold on. So if, if I could, is there a world where I can do something like? There's no way, right? Something like like if I if, if she flips over me like that, can I like? <laughs> I mean, that certainly works, right? But I don't even I don't know if that works all the time. Right? And you can, it's not even that hard. Like, it's not hard to react to, right? You can just TK it. Like, you, can, you can just TK that. It's not even that difficult, really. But the question is, is that, does that actually catch everything that you can do out of that? Please tell me you saw Worldwide Part 2. Wait, it's, uh, like, the, the cards? It's the it's the family Kamehameha, right? It's Broly and uh, and Gohan. And the Gohan is, like, a Gohan, Goten, and Goku standby. Yes? Yeah, it looks really cool. Broly looks amazing, I think. Broly, Broly looks super good. He looks exactly what uh, his villain teams needed, too. Which is, which is great. And his domain doesn't clash with, like, AGL Broly either, which is amazing. The Gohan, I'm still holding out uh, Judgment. Wait, so it, is that, is that, out of curiosity, is that going to catch her? So if she, if she does the other thing, now, she also she can go straight up off of this? Yeah, that's, I mean, that'll obviously get caught by Borsh. No need to worry about that. That's really minus. But uh, if she does the little back jump, oh, I want to I do the full thing with the kick and everything. Huh, huh. So if she does this, and I try to Borsh. You know? Maybe, I guess that's the answer for Geef, huh? Hey, do it all, can I, do I have to TK into the, uh... Yeah, I have, to, I have to TK into the EX one. Yeah, because the other ones aren't fast enough, don't have the range, but... If I do it properly, you can TK into the, the EX Borscht, huh? Yeah. And even if she tries to jump away, it catches her. Okay, what if she doesn't stick out the leg, though? Because the leg might be extending her grab her box. If she just flips back the proper way, is she okay? I love that, yeah. And again, it's not even, like, it's not even, like, that. it's that unrealistic, right? Because... Like this, this kick is super reactable, right? So like, just when you see this, just you know, you can you can even buffer the TK. It's not even that hard. Uh, but if he just flips back normally, is she safe now? Like, is the kick extending her hurtbox? Maybe. Nope. Okay. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So it does cost two drive meter because if if you don't spend the EX version, she won't get. Uh, if you don't spend the, the if you don't if you don't spend the EX meter, she doesn't get caught when she backflips like that. At least. 
Wait, unless, unless like the light ones have more range or something? No, it doesn't look that way, yeah. I don't know how the uh, how the Borsks uh, differ from each other. Yeah, but it looks like EX is the only one that's fast enough to catch her in time. Are there are there startup differences? I should probably know this a little bit better, but I don't. You know, we're, you know, we're in maintenance right now, so it's a great time to just try some stuff out and see. Uh, wait, please stop. Kimberly! Okay, so you're jumping. Uh, you start up in four frames. You start up in... What? There you go. Four frames? Was that also four? That was also four, right? Oh, oh wait, can you not do Borscht out of a... No, you can't. Okay. Four frames, and then the light one, four frames, and the EX one, four frames. Yeah, okay, so the startup isn't different. I just assume that... Oh, wow. Yeah, Borscht, so from here... Bor so, let me, let me, so if I'm standing on this marker, and I heavy Borscht... Oh, I want to jump straight up, please. So if his knee is right past this black, bo EX Borscht hits. If his knee is right past the black... Oh, okay, that's, it's a range difference. Got it. And there's no one that's uh, as good there. I'm trying to jump straight up, please. I don't know why I find it so hard for me to buffer a borscht. Shouldn't be. I want to jump straight up and then get a borscht, and it's not working very... Oh, okay, okay. Wait, is light bigger than heavy? Oh, God. Kimberly, stop. Is light bigger than heavy? Looks like light is maybe bigger than heavy. Yeah. Is it, is it, so it's like the other SPDs too, then? Wait, so is light bigger than EX? Oh! Wait, maybe it is. Hold on. I'm just so acid jumping straight up and then borsting. What the heck? Looks maybe like it, right? Because like when his knee is kind of behind the black line right here. EX whiffs, but when his knee is right behind the black line here. Oh, light also. Oh, wait. Well, he wasn't in, I don't think he was near me there. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, I jumped forward. My bad. Well, it looks like light and EX are similar anyway. Steam's done. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get back into it. I'm just kind of I'm now I'm just kind of like curious about this now. Wait, maybe maybe EX yeah, maybe I jumped forward that one time. Maybe EX is still bigger. It's kind of hard to tell. I'm not gonna lie, especially because I'm bad at the input. Imagine light and EX are the same. Yeah, maybe. But if so, that means we, we don't have to spend. The reason I'm curious about this, I'm, I'm wondering if there's a way to to not spend. Two drive bar to punish Kimberly's punish. Uh, to punish Kimberly's little flippy dippy there, basically, right? There's gotta be a hitbox viewer mod for this game somewhere, right? Probably can go on super combo and check. Okay, so I guess the easiest way to confirm this is yeah, let me just have her do this over and over and try to light borst it. Nope. Yeah, it seems like light whiffs. Like, I'm not sure why, but it seems like I, you know, no matter how fast I TK light and whiffs, but when I EX, it works. So there's got to be a slight range advantage for EX, right? Okay, yeah, it's, it's it's good to know. Uh, by default, I think it's still a good idea to just, like, have our default answer be just hit the chop, right? But if we see a Kim that, like, knows, basically, like, that Kim hits us with that, that fade away, like that. Which actually didn't punish us right there, so I'm, I'm messing up the timing on that slightly. Let me, let me try and do that better where it'll actually punish me. Like that. I think works now. Well, I delete the recording. Done me recording ready. Oh. Like, mash it as fast as you can, play the recording, and now that'll punish me. Yeah, okay. Does this still get caught by Borscht? Yes, okay. So, if we, we do this by default, and if the Kim seems like they know what's up, if they punish us for this once, right, then we start doing this. Oh. Because it seems like, basically, no matter what Kimberly does, as soon as she commits to that, she's dead, right? As soon as she commits to that, she's guaranteed Borshted. So. Interesting. There's one in the game that they, they disabled on release for some reason? That's very odd. Okay, okay, cool. That's, you know, I, honestly, I, I was just coming in here to, to, like, pass some time and steam maintenance. That we, I, that's something really cool for the Kimberly matchup, man. You can just, like, whenever she does this, if you if you, if you have two drive gauge to spend, it's a guaranteed borscht, it seems like. Because, I mean, I don't think any of her options will save her from this. This, like, the, the back one here is the most evasive one, right? And we saw, even if she doesn't stick out her legs for that uh, jumping heavy kick there, she still gets grabbed, so. That's 3,000 damage, man. That's a lot of damage. That'll kill her, uh, you know, from a lot of distances. Cool. Uh, awesome. Well, hopefully Steam is back, is it? I'll, I'll reboot SF6 and things like that between uh, the videos here, but let me just send YouTube on their way. Get Borsted Nerd Russian Brick properly. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to say that in Russian, but something like that. Yeah, YouTube, hi, how's it going? Hope you had a good time with the video. I know I sure did. Uh, playing some good geef here, I think, today. Playing some decent geef. Uh, but yeah, uh, if you like the video, any kind of like, subscribes, comments, bells, all that stuff, obviously greatly appreciate it. Also, I stream every day from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. Eastern, so if you want to come by and hang out, I think I have a good time and encourage you to do so. I also have a discord if you'd like to join that a great place to hang out you know talk about fighting games make some friends all that good stuff 
Uh, if you do join, that'll be nice. Or I'll shoot you in the head in Minecraft. Most importantly, I hope you had a great time hanging out today, as always. I know I sure did. Have a lot of fun with the big boy. Yeah, very fun discovery on that uh, some Kim counterplay there. Most of the time doesn't matter. But again, that Kim showed me that you can't just hit the credit card swipe like I thought and always get the punish, right? So uh, good to learn for sure. Also, some more, a higher damage punish if you just want to kill them for doing that, right? But yeah, having a lot of fun with Geef. Going to be a lot more coming your way. And until then, I will see you in the next one. Peace.